What's going on everybody? It's your girl Sneaker Mom back in the building, back with another review for you guys. Today I'm going to be reviewing the new Vans Joe Fresh Good collaboration. Let's get into it. nice pink box that says vans on the top with joe fresh goods also we're gonna flip to the side you got your uh checkerboards right here with jfg for joe fresh goods flipping to the back you just got a normal little vans uh skateboard right there that says vault but then we're gonna get to the front of the box and it reads og style 36 lx and the colorway is joe fresh goods khaki and check let's get into it opening up the box which as you can see you have a nice pull out box pulling it out and then you had this nice just cream tissue paper shirt that has JFG going all throughout the tissue paper for Joe Fresh Goods. Nice touch to tissue paper but that's about it for the inside of the box. So let's get into the main ingredient of this video and that is the Vans Joe Fresh Good collaboration khaki. <music> Alright, first I'm going to start off by saying this colorway right here is my favorite out of the three. My opinion, I like this one the best. It's just something about how this khaki came out on this uh, style. I really like it. So let's get into the aspects of the shoe. As you can see, you had this nice suede, khaki suede on the top of the toe. We're going to go ahead up to these shoelaces. They had these nice khaki shoelaces. They came with some cream cell shoelaces also, but I think... I'm sticking with the khaki on these. I like it. Y'all let me know what you think. Would you keep these or would you go with the sale? I'm going to show you the sale in the other shoe. But let's go on to the side of the shoe. As you can see, we had this checkerboard print come across the side of the shoe that has JFG going throughout the checkerboard. Then you got that normal band symbol right here coming across the side and this khaki leather. We're going to flip to the back of the shoe. You got this nice hairy suede going on on the back of the shoe. Then you got that normal band stamp right here on the back in khaki, which is nice. It just says off the wall originals normally we used to have that in red in most of the styles but this time they gave us a khaki one that matches the shoe which i like a lot we're gonna flip to this side of the shoe also it looks the same as that way you got those same checkerboard prints going across with the jfg going through the checkerboards same normal band symbol right here on the side and that's pretty much it for this side of the shoe but then we're gonna go back into the inside top of the shoe right here where we got the uh inside of the ankle part you got that nice leather khaki leather coming across the sides of the ankle and then on the inside it says vans originals and it says joe fresh goods on the inside which is nice then we're just gonna go back to the side i'm at bottom of the shoe you got this nice uh cell rubber coming across the side of the shoe going all the way around the shoe then you got that little hint of a yellow strip coming across the uh side of the shoe also and leather but then we're gonna flip to the bottom of the shoe you had a nice translucent bottom which i think is a very nice touch to the shoe because normally we used to have those brown bottoms on the bottom bottom of vans so this is a nice translucent uh colorway very nice on the bottom of the shoe but yeah that was pretty much it for the, uh, this shoe just a normal uh vans 30 lx 36 lx style which i really like this style very lightweight very easy to just wear all day and just very like i said very comfortable shoe these right here i will go true size i usually wear a women's size seven and a half so that's the same size i get in my vans women's size seven and a half or a man's size six or you can just flip it around men's size six women's size seven and a half this was a, a right shoe let's get into the left shoe it looks the same as that way but as you can see i've added those uh cream laces in this shoe so y'all let me know would you keep these cream laces in or would you go with the khaki laces that it came with let me know which one would you go with cream or khaki like i said i'm sticking with khaki on this style but uh you let me know which one would you go with either one of them but they both look nice but it's just something about how the khaki look in these that to me makes the shoe pop a little bit more but like i said there you go with the khaki so i meant with the cream so y'all let me know but let's continue with the uh, aspects of the shoe still got those nice checkerboards coming across the side with the jfg going through there with those white and khaki checkerboards coming back to the toe of the shoe you got that nice uh suede right here on top of the toe going all the way up to the whole tongue is also in suede like sales shoelaces side of the shoe you got a nice 
uh, band symbol and that khaki leather coming across, going across to the back of the shoe. You got that hairy suede khaki in the back with that band symbol in the back of the shoe and that khaki also. Then we still got that nice cream uh, rubber coming across the side of the shoe with that yellow strip coming across around the shoe also. Flipping to the bottom of the shoe, you got that nice translucent bottom. Pretty much tops the shoe off, like I said. Very nice shoe, very comfortable, very easy to wear. But to me, out of the collaboration, he had this color, the khaki, the pink, and the red. I went for the pink and the khaki, so I, I really like the pink. Pink, pink is my second uh, pick. But this out of all three, the khaki pair is number one pair for me. I like this color the best. You let me know down in the comments below which colorway did you like the best, the red, the khaki, or the pink. Let me know down in those comments below. But yeah, that's pretty much it. The Joe Fresh Good Vans Style 36 LX. Like I said, very nice style. Very easy to style with. Very durable shoe and very lightweight. So y'all let me know what y'all think about these down in the comments below. Uh, that's all I got for y'all today. If you're new to watching my channel, hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell so you can know when I post all my videos. Follow me on Instagram at sneakermom1721. And until the next time, it's your girl Sneaker Mom. Peace. Production.